Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch and it's the first Tuesday of the month, so you know what that means. Time for some Unreal Free... Wait a minute, it's not Tuesday, that already happened. Actually, we're getting more free Unreal stuff and it's actually a really good selection. But I gotta warn you, about half of what we're looking at today, you have to get it by November 1st. But it, it is all... Free. So if you don't know, basically the first Tuesday of every month, Unreal Engine gives away a bunch of stuff. And this month they gave away five assets, but there was nothing in the permanently free collection. And as I commented in that news post, generally when this happens, Unreal announces another free asset pack during the month. So it'll be interesting to see if that trend remains true. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that trend remains true. We've got something going on called Education Week. I'll come back and talk about Education Week in just a second. But first off, I'm going to focus on the assets. We all like the free stuff. And then we'll get back and learn about blah, 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 education stuff later. There's actually some really nice stuff going on here. And these are assets that are meant to kind of facilitate your journey with Unreal Engine and all of that. But instead, let's go take a look at what we get for free. And it is three really high quality assets. So the first one we get is the top-down starter kit. A top-down starter kit project is a starter kit for creating locations of stylized worlds. Uh, you can see some of the results here and here and here and so on. Um, here is the working scene, top-down RPG game with one location. Give you a quick start in developing your own unique, colorful, stylized RPG or RTS game. Uh, in this game, the main character of Barbarian Girl Victoria moving around the location destroys training dummy. Here you will find many objects or filling locations, trees, plants, stones, ruins, water plant, wooden object, and various visual effects. Um, so here's what you're getting in it, a stylized character, obviously the logic behind them, uh, the enemy characters, all the stuff we just talked about there. Basically some VFX stuff here, uh, including, hey, I can say defoliation. No, I can't, actually. Uh, so we've got here 122 meshes in this pack, a number of different materials, and so on and so forth. Definitely a nice one there. Let's see if we get the uh, every... No, we don't have the every asset kind of uh, beauty shot thing going on with this one. So again, November 1st. Buy this, air quotes, buy this for free. Buy November 1st, and it will be yours forever. Next up, we have the tiny... Uh, sorry, the Toonie Tiny RTS set. And I've got to actually argue that the um, art style between them is actually... It's close enough. You could actually probably use these two packs together. This is a cartoony uh, low-poly RTS units pack, and this one does have the beauty shots of what you're getting. I do really like the art style, to be honest. And I like also the fact everything here is pretty modular, so you should be able to do uh, mix and matches and make a very large number of characters. Also, this is simple enough in style and aesthetic that even if you're not much of an artist, you should be able to modify it, you know, if you need to change colors or the style, that kind of stuff. Uh, what you're getting here is 44 bodies, 70, 70 heads, 7 horse models, 9 war machine models, 75 weapon shields and equipment, 20 buildings, uh, 4 banner models, fully animated, uh, 1 single uh, 1024 by 1024 texture for all characters and weapons, 1 single 1024 by 1024 uh, for all buildings, so really lightweight, and 12 skin color textures, um, yeah, 140 animations in it, uh, so you're looking at 200 to... 800 triangles or sorry vertices per character so definitely lightweight and again this one pick it up by november the first and it is yours free forever and then we've got the arcade ultimate vehicles pack and i do have to give them credit everything they've done here i i, I gotta admit uh maybe medieval knights and vehicles don't really mash together in terms of logic uh, but in terms of the art style they've done a pretty consistent job with this nice toony set uh, this is an ever-growing 3D car package designed for driving racing games. Uh, I make updates with new vehicles every month. Here you can see all of the vehicles, and there's quite a few in here. Let's see if there's another... No, nah, there's not another overview shot. But if you wanted to make a top-down RPG... St or, sorry, racing-style game, uh, you could definitely pull assets from this one and from the first one uh, for your backgrounds and props and so on. So these are all obviously to facilitate the Education Week, but this is three really nice assets that are basically yours free as long as you pick them up before November the 1st. Again, big warning there, get them by November the 1st. And we're looking here, this pack contains 83 vehicles, um, five color coloration various um, variations each, uh, prefabs with and without colliders included, uh, vehicles use only two materials, again, very small in size for the textures here, uh, perfect for third-party racing and top-down style games. You see these things got racing cars, urban vehicles, tanks, helicopters, airplanes, buses, trucks, police vehicles, and motorbikes. Definitely nice there. And they just updated in October to add eight more vehicles. So this is the last of the free until November packs. 
And then we're not done here. They're also adding to the permanently free collection. I'll explain what that is to you in just a second. Actually, I'll explain it to you now. The permanently free collection is basically the permanently free collection right here. It's just um, assets. There's no time limit on when you pick them up. Uh, there is an absolute ton of stuff here. Uh, I don't know if these new packs have been added in here yet, but as you can see, there's several pages in the permanently free. No time limit on these ones, so you don't need to rush to pick them up. So let's go look at what is in the permanently free collection. We have the visual novel framework full system. So if you're trying to make a visual novel style game, uh, this is a setup for you. I believe it is entirely blueprint driven. Let's go back here to the description. Flexible scene system using data tables, including instructions on how to convert your external strips, scripts into usable CSV files, comma separated values, by the way, if you're wondering. Uh, ability to branch scenes based on conditions. Voice acting can easily be inserted used as sound cues. Uh, characters can spawn in 3D space or in UMG widgets. Um, so on and so forth. Uh, so if you're going for that visual novel sound kind of system, yeah, it is blueprints. 64 blueprints, in fact. Um, so that is what this one is all about. And you've got the tools for setting up the data tables for... Uh, the branching dialogues that happen. So if you're looking to make a visual novel using uh, the uh, Unreal Game Engine, uh, this one is, again, permanently free. Definitely nice to see that there. Uh, we've got the basic pickups VFX set, uh, a set of Niagara. Niagara is the inbuilt um, particle system inside of uh, Unreal Engine as of Unreal Engine like 4.23 or 4.24, somewhere around there. Basically, it's a bunch of special effects, VFX effects. Um, 18 unique VFX, totally 18 Niagara VFX. Yeah, so not really much more to say about that one. Uh, you can see some of the effects in action, but pretty straightforward. Probably the most underwhelming of the assets for the most part. And then finally, we've got the Interface and Item Sound Pack, a fantastic package of 117 high quality and game ready sound effects for user interface, items, power ups, and more. So pretty straightforward, things like pops, sci-fi UI sounds, clicks and buttons, coin switches, error buzz, special effects, uh, sell purchase items, so like coins jingling and so on, or cash registers ringing, that kind of stuff. Uh, there's a preview of the, I the sounds if you really want to come in and listen to them, or you can see a full list of the sound effects right here. Nah, I won't go back. So if you're interested in learning more, uh, that is there. Also, do keep in mind the Unreal Engine October giveaway is still in effect. You can get all of these assets, so these five items, are available until the first Tuesday of November. So even if you're not an Unreal Engine user, I highly recommend create an account and just start you know, stockpiling this stuff as it comes. Uh, but this one, back to Education Week. Um, so we're excited to announce the release of Unreal Engine assets. Each asset is chosen to help educators teach game design. They will remain free forever, some of them. So the last three we saw will. The other ones are going to end at 10 a.m. Eastern time on November the 1st. So again, keep that in mind. So we got the top-down starter kit, the uh, Toonie Tiny RTS set, uh, the arcade uh, vehicles pack, again, those are until November the 1st, and then all the rest from the visual novels to all the special effects and the item sounds, those are permanently free. Uh, I do believe they actually have a write-up. Let me just go, see if I can go back. Uh, Education Week. So there are some more details on Education Week as well. So from October 25th to 29th, you can explore Unreal Engine from virtually any angle. We have career and profile uh, portfolio tips, project breakdowns, special live stream with special guests, student educator interviews, learning resources, you name it, and it's probably here. No matter who you are, student, teacher, self-taught game dev, you will find something that will help you along your journey as a creator. And then, of course, the freebie stuff, which is what I focused on here. So you see a breakdown of what they are doing here. Um, so Monday, October the 25th, so also known as today. Um, that's where you can go ahead and download those assets. There's a bunch of deals going on, 50% off on the marketplace as well. Uh, October 26th, how to teach virtual production. So if you're in the filmmaking side of things, uh, how SCAD students are learning to fill real time's rising demand. Uh, and then on Wednesday, we've got teaching with Unreal, learn how to incorporate interactive 3D into your classroom. And then we've got exploring Ashigo behind the scenes of rookie award winning game environment. And then on Thursday, we have Canvas Tool Playground, The Many Shades of Real Time, uh, and then the 2021 Fall Student Showcase. And then on Friday, we have how Breda University of Applied Science is helping students follow their game dev calling. And what is an environmental artist? And I think that is it. So there's going to have a bunch of training courses going on through the week. But again, uh, the star of the show for me, and I think for most of you, is these new asset giveaways. And one last warning before I finish this video, go get them now. You've got less than a week to do so, and they are free. So a top-down starter kit, 
the uh, tiny, the tiny tiny RTS set, and of course the arcade Ultimate Vehicles pack. Those are all available. They're all really high quality, cool looking assets that are available until November the first. And speaking of limited time. Once again, remember that this month's uh, giveaway is still ongoing if you haven't already picked up the Fantasy Cave Environment Set, the Horror Dining Room Set, the Dismemberment and Bone Breaking System, Elite Landscapes Bundle Pack, and Surface Trails. Go get those as well. And if you want to stay up to date on the latest and greatest in the world of game development, especially free stuff, do hit that subscribe and like button and I will keep you up to date. All right, that's it. Uh, pretty huge giveaway. I was actually going to do like a hands-on demo uh, but I'm still waiting for the shaders to compile for my Unreal Engine 5 starter project. Uh, so I figured I'd get the video out instead, because I haven't even imported the new projects yet. I'm just waiting for this. So yeah, we, we're not going to do any hands-on demo today. Uh, so let me know what you think. Comments down below, and I shall talk to you crazy folks later. Goodbye.